I think you, you learn a variety of skills on the economics course. Uh, you do quite a lot of presentation, but, but also the sort of analytical mindset you develop is something that I found useful at least throughout my masters and, and throughout uh, my career so far. The amount of work and drive that you have to have getting through the economics degree at Warwick really helps with being able to keep determined and driven in the working world. I guess because I did an undergraduate in just straight economics and then specialised into behavioural and economic science. Everything was quite new to me, so I had a very interest in the field, um, but there was just so much discussion on a huge variety of different topics. And then of course you have the more technical aspects, which is like coding and R and um, all different kinds of analysis. The skills that I picked up at Warwick, which helped me the most, would be a sort of attention to detail, which you learn a lot during your PhD. Just, you know, persistence, because PhD is a long journey. And yeah, just, just staying focused. I think these are some of the, the key things I learned at Warwick, which are which just transfer across jobs. My favorite module here at Warwick was probably the behavioral economics module. The reason why I liked it is because there was quite an intersection between neuroscience, psychology, and economics. And that kind of interdisciplinary approach was something I didn't expect. I think it brought together a lot of my interests, and it's something that I see and have been able to apply day to day. I would say that my favorite module was time series econometrics, just because it was something that we built on compared to last year, uh, that we had the econometrics module, and we had the opportunity to see how you can sort of use past behavior to try and forecast some time series, which was uh, very interesting. There's a whole host of skills that I took from my economics degree and I'm applying in the everyday world from you know, the current inflation environment in the UK and actually understanding the driving forces around that to problem solving skills that I applied at McKinsey and Company where I was a manager to now as an entrepreneur making decisions every day. One of the things that work teaches you fantastically is the skill of problem solving. And they do it from the side of teaching you theoretical, technical, numerical skills. But on the other hand, you also learn how to look at things with intuition, understanding human behavior. So that when you deal with real world problems, you come at it from these two sides and end up with a solution that is complete and coherent. And that's been incredibly useful to me.